You may have seen that weird symbol we use It looks like a table that's losing its screws Well it's a Greek letter that is known as Pi And though it is useful you may not know why We use it for circular geometry To link the radius to more properties It represents a number that's round about three with decimals that go on infinitely And it's roughly 3.141592653589732384626432789 Now you're acquainted with this brand new word and you're aware it's completely absurd We have some equations that use it simply To find circumference you just use pi d From this we can tell that pi's only parameter Is that it's the ratio of circumference to diameter And to find the area well best be prepared To use the equation of Pi R squared I'll ask you this once and I'll ask you some more Isn't there proof that pi equals 4? Yes, but it's wrong and I'll tell you just why Because pi is actually 3.14159 But more precisely 3.141592653589732384626433832793.141592653589332789 Imagine a square Psi length 1 and with a perimeter which is there for uh, 4. Now chip away at the corners and if you do it right you'll be left with a circle after a very very long amount of time and its circumference will also be, also be 4 but Pi is a ratio as we heard before So circumference over diameter The ratio we want will Simply just become 4 over 1 Which is 4 But the proof is wrong well, because pi is actually 3.141592653589732384626433832793.141592653589732384626433832793.141 Now you're acquainted And that's pie.